Hello and welcome to Magsy's Fun Time. This is Magsy and we are back here on Tegan Sky, Tegan School to Thermaturgy. Uh, <coughs> I got me another monitor. Uh, it took me a couple of hours to get this set up. It still doesn't look right. I think I need new glasses because my glasses are all scratched up. I think that's making the image look a little worse than it is. But I've got it almost perfect. And uh, hopefully the image looks good for you guys. So we'll see when you guys uh, watch the video. Uh, I put some drawers up around here. Um, these are probably going to go into some 2x2 two two drawers right here. And this is probably going to go stay in there. Because I'm going to get a whole bunch of horse armor. Um, and I'll just put them in like that. So I did go mining. I'm gonna, that is for earth shards which I don't have any more of right now so um, what do I, I think I'll keep you on me for now it's only two blocks because I think I'd rather have cobbled in there Okay, so, we are in year two. Now, this is probably going to be a quick episode. I just want to get into alchemy real quick. And uh, these two are going to be really, really important, all right? So, um, this one we're not actually supposed to be doing yet. Yeah, just got to find the infusion altar, and that doesn't unlock until we get done with some of the alchemy here. So... The first thing we need to do is find the classroom six, which gives us some more drawers and some upgrades, which will be awesome for us. So, um, let's see, death. Yeah, we will take you off. Um, our professor. And this should lead us to the rest of the classroom. So it's the medical ward. Stop it, man. Yep. And then around here should be... Room 5. And I don't know why. That came up. That's weird. Let me try going upstairs. Is it down? It's downstairs, right? Yeah. Yep. Let's go down one stairs. It should be down here somewhere. Yep. Right here. Alchemy Lab. And uh, we're going to make a waypoint here. There we go. We're going to go into the quest for you. And now it wants us to make an alchemical furnace. In three alchemical emeralds, we were supposed to bring those up here from. Uh, yeah, but I think we're just going to make a couple of new ones. Yeah, let's go back to the crafting room. Uh, to complete that, we can just pick these up. Does that? There we go. All right. So we need another alchemical furnace and another alchemical construct. Let's 
So the furnace is arcane stone, a furnace, and a crucible. Okay. So we need. And do we have any more arcane stone? We have two. We probably just have to make some more. break that with that so let me get another pick there we go and let's see empty shards Stone. Cool. And a furnace. Like that, All right? There we go. New alchemical furnace. And then the other one's an arcane, I think. Do we have some of those? Hold on. We have three. Cool. And then one, two, three. there. There we go. Now I think I've only only two of these, but it'll be it'll be okay. Uh, we can put the extra one up here. I think we can do that. Yeah. Should be fine. Now let's go back to the alchemy lab. There we go. That goes there, and that goes here. Yeah, we only need one. I'll put this one downstairs. We'll do something with it. Let's eat. Let's go into our quest. Plain reward. It wants us to make quicksilver droplets. Okay, we can do that downstairs. And it wants us to make some essentia tubes, which we can also do downstairs. So let's go downstairs. Okay. Alright, so. What is this you say? You need to find an. You will need to find cinnabar ore. Bring it back and smelt it. You will get a ball of quicksilver. Place that inside the arcane work table to get the droplets. Okay. So we need Quicksilver. Oh, I was going to do that, wasn't I? Dang it. How much leather do I have? Let's go wreck some uh, cows. Uh, I got a bunch of stuff I plan on doing. Um, I'm going to upgrade this before the next episode. 
Um, we're gonna uh, feed and kill some of the cows and sheep and stuff down there. Well, not sheep, but uh, chickens and stuff. Make sure we got plenty of that. Um, I'm just gonna put these here. There we go. I'll probably just move those, but that's fine for now. Um, Quicksilver. You know what? I need I need some uh, ladders. That was super weird. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Anytime you smell this, sometimes you get the little droplet. So. Some of these, I, I need a bunch anyway, so. You can make more by doing that in Crafting Grid right there. There we go. And that gives us more cinnabar ore. Now we need essential tubes. So let's put you guys up and I don't have that unlocked. Let's read the quest. Hold on. In this class, you will be channeling the gaseous essentia into water jars. This way. The way to do this is through tubes. Tubes are provided in the classroom, but if you wanted to set up your, another area to experiment, you'll need your own tubes. Research in your textbook, Alchemy Essentia Tubes. So, Alchemy. Oh, we need recycling, of course. Classroom. What's that? I'm blind. There it is. I don't need that one yet. I'm gonna need that one later. And probably that one. Hold on. Get all these out of the way. Yep. I don't need the void jars. Alright. That should get us through to today's episode. Alright. Uh, what, what the heck you are? Oh, this is super easy, yeah. Uh, crafting room. And I need some glass. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, is that right? It's not that. That and like that. None of this. Time to recharge. I am going to be setting up my own. So. That's why I want more than just the eight. Go. 
All right. That's filled back up. There we go. And I think I'll just put that there for now. All right, what we, what we got? Item reward. And again, we are going to start collecting these. I'm going to get another chest and put it on top right there. For that. Next quest. How we doing on time? It's fine. I want to keep this to 20 minutes though. Uh, water jars. An alchemist needs to be able to store all essentia he or she makes. To do this, make water jars. For more information, see the textbook. Alchemy water jars. Alright, so. I'm going to put you in there. There we go. And the textbook. Uh, alchemy. Water jars and labels. This is the water jar recipe, which is just any kind of slab and glass panes with a water essence. And then the labels here is some paper, a slime ball, ink sack. We will have to wait on the slime ball because I haven't found slimes. I went searching for them before this episode. Uh, in between episodes, I need to go around to all the jungle areas and uh, try to find some. But until then, uh, we're going to have to wait on this. There's no way to actually craft that just yet. So, uh, what's the what's the quest at right here? Yeah, so we just need water jars right now. Um, a stack of you. Turn a stack of you into that. We'll get you, and then you. And then there we go. <laughs> there we go. We're one off, aren't we? Um, there we go. Good to go. All right. That gives us ten more. Sweet. Uh, Essentia. It wants us to have a 64 cobble and wants us to break that down in our thing upstairs. Head over to station one and place 64 cobble into the alchemical furnace with some coal or some elementum. And place a water jar on the right and the left of the furnace with connected tubes. Alright. So, uh, let's get a stack of cobble. There we go. And we head back to the alchemy lab upstairs. What we want to do is we want to put this in here, put this in here. What we're going to do is, is have this come up, okay? So this says earth, so we're going to put earth here. And now the only thing that can go in this jar is actual earth. So then we want to wait for Promito there. And then we'll put that there. There we go. Now we've got everything. And uh, it is requiring us to actually get uh, a jar of each. So if if you look at cobble here, it has one each. So 64 will give us a stack of this and a stack of this. So it should be fine.
Come on. Now, for the infusion altar thing, I will be gathering some of the resources up off camera and completing some of that just to uh, save time. Um, but the first initial quest, a couple quests I will do on camera. So I'll, I'll, I'll be doing this on camera while we do go do something else. Come on, we're so close. Okay. This one's fully done, so we had to just wait on these guys to pop out and fill these jars up. It does have to be a complete jar full all the way, so you have to wait till this, but the them say 64. I'm tired. I have only gotten like three hours of sleep yesterday and three hours of sleep the day before that. And then I had like an hour nap. So, there's that one. There's that one. There we go. And we'll get two water jars of massa. Now it wants us to get a hopper, it wants to give us some information, so let's look at that. While burning items in the alchemical furnace, keep your goggles of revealing on at all times so you can see the aspects being made. Also, the process may still stall if the items you are burning produced an aspect that isn't in one of the jars attached to the tube. Attached to a tube. Simply remove one of the jars and place the empty one until it, the aspect pushes through. In this way, you can sw keep switching the jars during the process until it is done. You can also put another tube out the back of the oblimic ob and place three jars. Yeah. So it'll be one, two, three on the back and then two off the top part. All right. So it wants us to make a hopper, attach a hopper to the front of the alchemical furnace to feed it items. So we're gonna go ahead and complete that and we're gonna run downstairs and make a hopper real quick. And I think we're gonna stop there. So uh, let's put these out of inventory there. Let's go to our crafting room. Let's grab five. And then put this on here. There we go. We're going to put this in the classroom. So, guys, if you like this episode, make sure you smack that like button. If you subscribe to my channel, make sure you set your notifications for my channel. And I'll send you notifications when I have new videos out. You guys can come check it out. See if you like it. If you do like this episode, you want to share it with your friends, tell them if you like it. There's a share tab down below. Click on the share tab, copy the link, post it on your Facebook, Twitter, wherever you do social media. If you have any tips, tricks, or comments, put them down in the comments down below. Also, as a reminder, I do have Facebook, YouTube, I mean, uh, Twitter. I'm also on Google Plus, so you can, those links are on my actual channel page. So you guys can click over from there. And I'll see you guys on the next episode.